What's going on guys, Briar Rabbit here, back with another Planet Destiny video. Today we'll be taking a look at what Lord Saladin has for this week's Iron Banner reward. So for the event rewards, we've got chest armor and for the very first time, helmet. So let's take a look at the chest armor. This comes in two flavors. First off, you can get intellect and strength and carry more ammo for fusion rifles and auto rifles, or you can get intellect and discipline and carry more ammo for shotguns and scout rifles. Next for the helmets, these also come in two flavors. The first being a roll with intellect and strength. Then the perks causing damage with a grenade reduces your melee cooldown and replenish super energy when you kill an enemy with a grenade. Or you can get one with intellect and discipline and the perks increase melee attack speed and increase super energy gain from killing minions of darkness. Next up, we have Ephrodite Spear. This has been one of the most popular sniper rifles inside the Crucible since its introduction. It is a very, very powerful sniper rifle, and it's great for both PvP and PvE play, depending on the role. The role it comes with is not awful. It comes with surplus, the choice of high caliber rounds, armor piercing rounds and perfect balance, and of course, Firefly. Not a bad roll, I'd probably re-roll it, uh, either for PvE or PvP. For PvP play, I'd probably look for Rodeo here, perfect balance, and most definitely final round in the final perk slot. For PvE play, I would like to see Field Scout. I wouldn't mind final round, but Firefly would be a good option as well. Next up, we've got the Hand Cannon Timmer's Lash. This roll on Timmer's Lash isn't too bad. It comes with performance bonus, armor piercing rounds, single point sling, explosive rounds, and crowd control. For PvP, if I were to re-roll this, I'd really be looking for Outlaw or Spray and Play. Uh, Field Scout would be another good one, and Final Round or Luck in the Chamber would make it really good. So that's it. Of course, you can reforge the weapons you already have, and you can buy a buff to gain more reputation quicker inside the Iron Banner. Don't forget that this week the Iron Banner is only available from the director interface, not from inside the Crucible menu. Thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned to Planet Destiny for more Destiny videos. And don't forget to come check out my channel over at Briar Rabbit Channel. Thanks for watching and we'll see you guys next time. Test yourself in the trials. Find the way through the darkness.